Hard to believe, yes I know, but many local schools are starting back up for school in just two or three weeks. For instance, parents and students in Grundy County, they say they're going to be ready. Oh yeah, the community came together and had their annual back to school bash this morning. Local 3's Riley Nagel was there. Just to make sure that kids are ready for school and have what they need to be successful at the beginning of their school year. The back to school bash is the perfect place for families to get some extra supplies before school begins in August. Volunteers were handing out items at 8 a.m., but cars began lining up hours before then. Uh, I got here about 530. Sandra Nolan didn't want to miss out on the limited supplies and says she isn't the only one who's grateful for the generosity. Well, supplies are so high and my little boy has four teachers and each teacher requires supplies. Thanks to partnerships between the Grundy County Health Council, the school district and the county safety coalition, parents were able to get backpacks filled with most school supplies a student may need. The families who showed up also got a five day lunch pack. We're planning to distribute about 3,500 meals. Um, our first time ever to do this. We're super excited about it. Several nonprofits joined the giveaway, including Mountaintop, which is a company who works to eliminate substandard housing in Grundy and surrounding areas. They were able to donate brand new socks to the parents. So we want to give back to our community as much as we possibly can. We just feel that that is super important in building a, a strong community is being able to work with the people and be able to give back to the people whenever possible. If your student attends Grundy County Schools but you missed the event, we have a link to a full list of items you'll need over on our website. Reporting in Grundy County, I'm Riley Nagel, Local 3 News.